Chainsaw Man is a manga that you may or may not have heard of. You might recognize it though, despite not knowing what it is exactly. You may have even seen some of the weird controversial stuff with the fandom where they bark for girls dressed up as a certain character from the manga. Perhaps you've even seen some of the fan art of Hamino, Kobeni, Power, or Makima, maybe even Denji or Aki. I'm sure you've seen some inkling of Chainsaw Man out there, and the hype around it right now is extremely real and tangible. That's because MAPPA Studios just had their 10th anniversary, and they celebrated last night with a live stream showcasing a lot of the new stuff that will be coming out this year. Obviously, the most anticipated anime preview for this entire showcase was Chainsaw Man, and they did not drop the ball on this whatsoever. It looks absolutely gorgeous. It's so gory. It looks just like what you'd want to see MAPPA execute and just see these moments that are in the manga be finally played out into an animated series. The Chainsaw Man trailer hits you off with these scenic moments that are sort of the slice of life of all the characters in the Chainsaw Man manga. You get to see Aki, Denji, and power, eating breakfast together, and then you get slapped into the extreme contrast of this macabre, dark, and gory manga that lurks beneath all of this peace. It's so awesome to see the fox devil pop out of this building. You get to see Denji's fight with the bat devil. You get to see a little snippet of power and Denji's first time meeting up and when they have to hunt devils together. You also get to see Aki using his sword, which I, I can't wait to see more of that and to see him have his contracts with new devils and things like that. There's even this little moment where you get to see how Power, Himino, Kobeni, Aki, Arai, I, I'm Arai, I'm not exactly sure how to say his name, and Denji are all locked on this eighth floor of this building when they're checking out things about this gun devil, which you'll know more about, or at least you might know about if you've already read the manga. It's really cool to see these still images come to life, because you even get to see that moment where they're running from the devil on the eighth floor, and you get to see Denji kind of shoving Aki behind him. <laughs> He's really trying to get, like, Aki to get killed by this devil, and there's just moments like that that get expanded in the anime and I cannot wait to see them and it looks like MAPPA or MAPPA however you say it of course I'm gonna be saying things in a little bit of a butchered way but I cannot wait to see how they bring this manga to life my one complaint about the animated preview is that it was too damn short man that was a five hour live stream of the 10th anniversary of MAPPA and you guys just give me a minute out of it for Chainsaw Man Come on, you're holding back on me. I mean, I appreciate it because I, I can't wait to see it, you know, once it comes out. But I just, I wanted like maybe two, three minutes. Come on. If you're still kind of unsure as to why there's so much hype for MAPPA Studios to be taking over the animation for the Chainsaw Man manga, you might recognize some of these other titles at least a little bit, and I'll just mention the ones that I've definitely watched entirely. MAPPA was responsible for Garo Vanishing Line. They were also behind Doro Hey Doro. And some of the most noteworthy ones that you more than likely will recognize are the final season for Attack on Titan, the first half that came out, and the first season of Jujutsu Kaisen which I think most people know about by now. If any of this has piqued your interest, you may not know about Chainsaw Man, you may not watch anime, you may not know why you're even watching this video. <laughs> but if any of this has piqued your interest and you're still unsure as to whether you want to dive into the manga before the anime comes out, I do suggest checking it out. At least you can read it free online. I like buying the physical copies because it's just nicer to read. But I'll give you the story summary that comes from Tatsuki Fujimoto themselves. Denji is a young man who hunts devils with his pet devil dog, Pochita. To pay off his debts, Denji is forced to live in extreme poverty and work like a dog, only to be betrayed and killed on the job without ever getting to live a decent life. But Pochita, at the cost of the pooch's own life, brings Denji back as Chainsaw Man. After Denji buzzes through all of their attackers, he's taken in by the mysterious Makima and begins a new life as a public safety devil hunter. 
Dingy defeats the Bat Devil and rescues Power. So as promised, she lets him squeeze her breasts. Yes, this is this is part of the manga. His, ha <laughs> His first handful of boob turns out to be a letdown. But when Makima tells the delusional Dingy about the strongest devil, the Gun Devil, her offer to grant Dingy any one wish if he can kill the Gun Devil brings his motivation back big time. Dingy and the members of the Special Division 4 are soon dispatched to a hotel where the devils that ingested a piece of the Gun Devil have been sighted. Hamino gives Dingy some extra motivation with a promise of her own. If he's the one to defeat this devil, she'll kiss him with tongue. <laughs> However, the mission goes awry when the devil traps the group on the hotel's 8th floor with a mysterious power. As the extreme situation wears everyone down, the devil offers them a deal. Let it eat Dingy, and it will let them go. Personally, I'm extremely excited to see the fight between Samurai Sword, Chainsaw Man, Aki, Mino, and Power. The first moment when they first meet up is just so intense, and it changes the pace of the manga entirely. I can't wait to see moments where it's like Dingy's first kiss. If you know, you know. <laughs> That's going to just be something to see. Ah, man, I can't wait to see some of these moments. The fight with the Bat Devil, I, like a lot of the devils are very cool, and I can't wait to see them animated. The stills of them in the manga are honestly just beautiful drawings, but to see them taken to life by MAPPA Studios is going to be just so awesome. I highly suggest Chainsaw Man. I know there's a ton of hype around it already, and it's not even an anime yet. I have no idea what this fandom's going to turn into once it's animated. It's going to be insane. Definitely check it out. Hit me up on Twitter if you guys want to suggest anything for me to see. Join the Discord server. You, you get the deal. All right, just do what I say, okay? I'll see you all next time. Everybody take care. Later.